the surface continues to draw criticism from the United Nations as India and Pakistani colonial forces continue their offensive to gain control over the valuable deposits in the Sea of Taisho. We go now to a special report from Tim Smith. This is Tim Smith reporting for the British Imperial News Network at the Indian Lunar Compound. The miners and their families have been steadily arriving from the outer colonies as Pakistani forces have raided through the agreed DMZ. This has caused a flood of people trying to escape the renewed hostilities. There are many wounded here, and many more are afraid for the future. They came out of nowhere. One minute, we were beginning the normal mining operations just outside New Mumbai. The next, we heard gunfire. It was horrible. I barely escaped. Oh, shit. The United Nations has already given a condemnation of the aggressive actions made by the Pakistani government. However, neither Pakistan nor the New Sino Alliance has made any effort to respond or comment on the claims. Though awaiting confirmation, there have been reports of the new Mumbai mining facility being voided, with the loss of all those trapped within. The New Sino Alliance has refused to comment. Tim Smith there, reporting from the Lunar Colony. Well, the freshly reopened conflict on the moon's surface has caught the attention from across the political and media fronts with Phoenix Peckham, in particular, taking to the online community to raise awareness and charitable donations from other celebrities enjoying the Cannes Film Festival. He has, however, spoken out against any thoughts of the nation going to war. We should all remember the lives lost today on the moon. And though I accept this award gladly, I do so with a heavy heart, knowing that even now there are people up there suffering and dying. The worst of the warmongers who would use this to drag us into a new war. Though people up there might be hurt, we cannot risk making things worse. We have to stand together to prevent our government leading us into another humanitarian disaster. Oh, big words. Careful not to hurt yourself, kid. Words, not war. Remember, everyone, I am New Mumbai. Cannes Film Festival there. We go now to Downing Street for an official press release from the Prime Minister. The Prime Minister condemns the Pakistani breach of the ceasefire in the strongest possible terms. The attack on New Mumbai is a clear breach of the treaty and will be met with dire consequences. Will there be a bombing campaign? Is Mr Johnson going to war? Until there is confirmation on what has happened and the exact situation, the government will not be voting on its exact response. However, I am able to inform you that British troops and armed forces are not, have not, and will not be taking action on the lunar surface at this time. Bullshit. Ezok, have you not heard the bell? We're up. I need the new gear you said you had. Yeah, yeah. You had it out there then? Transport's leave in five minutes. Indian Army is too busy taking care of things here. We're going into New Mumbai. Gonna try and retake that rock. Try not to get killed. Apparently, we're not meant to be here. You say that every day. I'm not meant to be here. Yeah, right. You're completely innocent, just like the rest of us. Don't you have a plane to catch? Thanks, Ezok. I'll return this as soon as I get back. You better. And don't get holes in it. As soon as he gets back my arse. I can see right through him. Solaris 2010 here. Report. So it was us who arranged this? Once the penal troops recover the mine, you will need to locate the meteorites the Indians just uncovered before the Indian troops do. Ensure it's safe return to Earth. Not really my area. I'm just a quartermaster, remember? Arrangements have been made. Simply ensure the local commanders do not interfere. Once you've completed your duties, your position on the lunar operation is to be liquidated. You are being reassigned. About time. Be sure to select a bodyguard from any surviving penal troops. No evidence can remain on the moon. Solaris 001, out. No evidence, eh? Understood, you son of a bitch.